I don't know if you can see it on the camera. What? The strobe that this light is doing. In case that light wasn't annoying enough with its sound, now it's strobing out. All of you guys are asking for stickers. You guys are all commenting, and I'm just gonna answer all your comments right now. You guys want stickers because I showed you them. I showed you guys one of these committed stickers. I put it on the back of the Civic and I put one on Derpy's hood and I think that's all I've done with them so far, but we got a bunch of these, well not a bunch, we got some of them made as kind of like tester stickers. So we don't have a lot of them yet. And what I'm gonna be doing is you guys want a bunch more stuff. So, well my, my plan, my plan right now is when I hit 100,000 subscribers to release a bunch of stickers, a new shirt, and a couple things for you guys. I'm not gonna do it yet. I'm gonna start small when I get to 100,000 and just kind of release things as it happens. Um, but I'm not gonna do it yet. So all you guys that are asking, don't ask anymore. You know it's coming. You just have to wait till we get to 100,000 because that's what I have said I'm gonna do. I don't really know why, but that's what we're doing. You guys gotta wait till 100,000. Anyways, in classic Vancouver fashion, today we are going to a car show in the rain again. And I was not gonna film again today. I was like, oh, we're just going to the car show. But lately when I've been filming things I wouldn't normally film, you guys have been really liking it. So I'll probably stop giving this speech in front of all the films <laughs> that I think you guys won't enjoy. And I'm just gonna film and put it out and whether you guys watch it or not, at least it's there for you guys that do enjoy it, so. This is just a good, good downpour. Here comes Emerson, I can hear him. Oh yeah, those are big raindrops. We're getting wet today. You know something that's hard to do? Can you hold this? I always want to film and show these guys like when you clip in the steering wheel like I do in the Civic but you have to push this back to get it in at all like it won't rest in there until you press this so I literally can't even like put it there and then manipulate it with like one hand I have to put the camera down I can never show them me clipping it me and Emerson are gonna go meet Derpy and then we're all gonna squat over to this meet some of you guys were saying like you didn't know who he was or you were like saying you know you should introduce him to the channel I did introduce him to the channel and I, I showed you guys the time I first met him at Stance Wars and I showed you the first time he ever hung out with us when we like blew his car a little bit and uh, me and Emerson drove it and I, I introduced him to you then but lots of you guys still don't know who he is so he's like an Instagram what do you even call that he's like, I'm like a youtuber and he's like an Instagrammer he's known on Instagram very well he's a local car guy in Vancouver he has a very sick car and he's now my one of my friends so that's who he is for you guys that don't know we just call him derpy because his Instagram is derpy frs he has a real name, but we call him Derby. And some people call him Dad, because he's old. Up your dreams to your silly demons. I don't know how long we're gonna end up staying at this meet. I don't know how many people are gonna be there. Like, we drove by to get here to meet Derby, and there was people leaving, because it's raining, like, real bad. Look at your maid, folding your pants for you. I said not to fold them, and then she's like, I wanna fold them. If I give you some gas, can we go off-roading if this meet's a bust? Maybe. Text Brad and give him a heads up that that's what we might do. Our grill was like this. On the Civic, we wouldn't have had to hack everything. We could just have double air on the intercooler. There's the late man. The late. I can't believe this thing's on bed. What? Wow. That's Jeez. nice. Thanks for showing up. Yeah. Sorry, my bad. It's all good. Yeah, yeah, you're leading me. I always lead. <laughs> you're the only one that knows where we're going ever. So many people with us, I don't even know. Lots of new friends with us, that's what I should be saying. There's lots of new friends with us today. <laughs> Follow him? Yo, this is cool. We keep going places and getting like the most VIP spots. This thing is so nice, and it's on bag. And a girl drives it, so all the subscribers are gonna shit their pants. <laughs> Why are you wearing this? <laughs> Derpy's selling his wide body. He's actually gonna get another one. Well, he got like a narrower one. So he's selling these fenders. Got a couple of kids here checking them out. Sound probably sucks, but this is my setup. You guys are just under a blanket for now. Yo, I didn't know Evan Shanks was in Canada. I want to get one of these for the Civic to cover all the shit on the front end. <laughs> That's nice. This is nice. That's nice. Chris, yours is nicer if you're watching this. That would be a sick color for the Civic. The size of the turbo is literally the size of the 1.5 in the Civic. I'm mighty bored and my camera's getting soaked. See you, buddy. Bye. So we're leaving the meet now. We met a couple of you guys. It was kind of a bummy meet. It was like really raining, not just like spitting like it was last night, like it was really raining. I think we're gonna go get Brad's Jeep and Emerson's truck. We're gonna swap around some cars. Then we're gonna go do some Jeep things. Go home and change and get out of our wet stuff and get into something that can get like real nasty. And then I'll just pick the camera back up whenever something starts happening again. What's Holy up? setup in here. Holy, there's a lot of deers. There's 
One, two, three. That I can see from right here. Hey, come here. Bambi, come here. Come here. Come here. Don't just look at me. Fine, you're no fun anyways. You guys know Brad from, he's been in a couple videos. He just like, I'll just put some clips from stuff he's been in. And we got Brad here to help us. Hey buddy. Hi. The tongue out there. I do that too. Ah! He sold the 240 and now he's got this Jeep. So I'm just gonna let him tell you about the Jeep because I don't know anything about it. But basically it was a really rainy, shitty day. So Emerson's gone home to get his truck that we took camping. And then Brad actually has like an off-road capable Jeep. So we're just gonna, I don't know. I don't do Jeep things, so. Okay. Tell peeps about your Jeep. So I have a 2007 Jeep Wrangler. It has a four and a half, four inch Skyjacker lift. It has 35 inch tires, eBay light bar. <laughs> Got some cool That's everybody's favorite. Flat. eBayLights.com. Yeah. I got like a really good winch. Worn. Uh, got a nice bumper on the front. I cut the fenders myself. It's pretty cool. There's a there's a good chunk of my audience that'll actually really like this thing. It's uh it's a definitely more capable than Emerson's truck is. But him and Emerson installed like these lights. They're like the RGBs, right? They just change a bunch of colors. Yeah. So they installed those a couple weeks ago, and then he's just got like little light pods like all over the sides of it. Big ass light bar. This is like when I say should I do a drift builder or four x four? This is like a heavy four x four option. Oh, there. There they are. Dude, those are sick. No, it's not legal, but hey, it's all right. I'm excited to do Jeep things to see if you guys are even interested in it, like see if you guys like it, because if so, like we could do some fun Jeep things, dude. Hi friends. I'll stay in here for now. I'll come with you guys at some point. This is, oh. the, hard part. This is the fine part. This is nice. Once we start going uphill, that's when it gets a little hectic. There he is. Good job, mate. You're doing great. I was gonna like stick it out the window to film, but I think I'm gonna get attacked by trees if I do that. There. Oh, there it is. No, we are gonna oh. put it into four low. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. <laughs> you have holy shit handles. It's fine. <laughs> gotta hold the camera. <laughs> this video is gonna be horrible. <laughs> it's gonna be so bad. Ah, uh, there he is. No, oh, no, he's going backwards. <laughs> oh, we made it. Go, buddy, go. Yeah. I was sliding, I'm like, yeah. I saw you show up and then go away. And I was like, oh no. <laughs> and the back gets started slipping and I was like, I'm gonna retry that. <laughs> it's like the camera never captures this stuff the way it should, but like, this is like quite the slope we're on. But like you look at it on the camera, it just looks like flat. Yeah, I wish, I just wish they could see how aggressive this like stuff was in real life. Oh, you're just gonna take this tree right out. Yeah, we don't really have an option. <laughs> see you later. <laughs> Sorry, <I'm mixing. laughs> oh yeah, this is a full set. I don't know if he's gonna like this. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna get out at the top. I want to watch him try this. Oh, we barely even did it. No, we're good. Dude, I'm looking for good content. You're supposed to get stuck. What is this? It's a frontier. Oh, she's whooping ass, ass, dude. Let's try and get up onto that little tree that we're going to slip. I'm surprised this Frontier sends so hard. <laughs> My hair just came out. Give him a minute and then if he doesn't pop up, we'll go find him. You got stuck in the turn? Yeah, it's just like loose dirt. Yeah. And then so I'm like, well, I'm not, I tried it twice. I'm like, no. So I shoved a whole bunch of rocks. Oh, so out. I'm just like, hold the fuck on. We are just the tree flowers. This is so fun. I definitely should have brought a GoPro, but I didn't think about it. But next time we'll bring a GoPro because this is actually really cool. It's just hard to get footage with the camera like bouncing around a hundred times. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, dude, Emerson's bottomed out hard. I don't know if you guys can hear the scraping. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh my god, I did not think he'd make it. Oh, he's not. In the water. Dude, he's legit tearing down everything underneath him. You can't go back now. No, you're good. Oh, your rear end might might just hook on the ground over there. Dude, this truck is just impressing me. Uh-oh, he's stuck. Nope. Yeah, man! Good job! <laughs> Don't kill me! You made it. You're good, dude. You're gonna make it. You wanna see my front bumper disappear? Kinda. Oh. <laughs> oh, that sounds so bad. Send it! He destroyed the log. You mucked the whole thing. We got all the way up to this like little rocky place where we just were. And it's raining really bad, so I try, I'm like trying not to film outside as much as I can because I want to give you guys more videos this week and not completely kill my camera. Can we turn this down just, just a little bit? <laughs> we get all the way to the top and the only way to get back is to go back down the same thing. So, and next time I will bring a GoPro and like some better equipment. And I'm anticipating you getting stuck on that hill that you came down, like the very end. The See ya. Now you gotta do that. I'll go up there and then I can watch you get stuck. <laughs> His bumper's just so low all the time. Uh oh. 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 Uh -oh. <laughs> you made it! Well, if I was gonna go slower than negative five kilometers, I would have got stuck. You should see some bushes I couldn't see. I'm like, I'm just gonna go. If I hit a tree, I hit a tree. Like that guy just got on the trail, so he's he kind of just got to get out of the way. Unless he's gonna, dude, he's in a Jeep Liberty. He's gonna get stuck. See ya. Oh man. I know. Good luck to you, my friend. Stock Jeep Liberty trying to do this. That we made it. Get stuck. No, I think uh, I think they're going up there to uh, to have sex. <laughs> So that's pretty much gonna end today's video. I don't know where we where we exactly left it off, but that was kind of cool. It was something different, something I don't usually do, but I did at one point ask you guys, like, would you like to see a four x four? Would you like to see like a drift build? And it was a pretty even vote. So it was like 50-50 for both. Um, but that's just give you like a little bit of taste of what it would be like, I guess, if we did get a, like an off-road vehicle. Obviously, I should have brought my GoPro. <laughs> I should have been better set up because I don't even know how much of this footage was good, how much of it was usable, but I just did my best with what we have. I mean, I've never done that before, filmed off-roading, so I didn't know what to expect um, it would have been better if I could mount some GoPros and stuff but either way we still went we had some fun and I tried to bring you guys along so let me know what you guys think of the videos the last two days it's just kind of been like what we're doing and maybe it's not installs and whatever you guys say you want to see more vlogs and you want to see more of like the day-to-day -day kind of stuff so obviously the content won't turn into just this but on days that I don't have anything to do like we're just waiting for civic parts and we have a bunch of stuff on the way but we're just in like this awkward spot where nothing's here yet but if you guys enjoy these there's a lot of times where this is happening and like we're just doing fun stuff and I just haven't recorded it because I didn't think it was entertaining enough for you guys I guess but let me know what you thought of the videos for the last two days because if you are enjoying them there's something I can do almost all the time because I'm doing stuff like this almost all the time. I just don't record it. That's all I'm going to have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you next time. Peace out and stay committed.